Boker Tov to everybody. Good morning. It's so good to see everyone today. I'm going to give everyone a minute to hop online. The numbers are creeping up. I hope everyone had a wonderful Shabbat and Sunday and that we're all doing okay this morning. I have to say, I just had the pleasure of guiding 56 people in a community meditation from my house, which was pretty, pretty awesome. Um, if you didn't join this morning and you're interested in joining tomorrow, we're gonna do it every day, Monday through Friday. Uh, the link is on the homepage. So if you feel like joining, come on in. I am here today with my Schecter wear. So show me your Schecter wear. If you're wearing Schecter, stand up, show me, put it in the middle of your picture. Let's see all that Schecter pride. I love it. I'm gonna scroll through my pictures so I can see all of that Schecter pride. Amazing, I see some of you have the same t-shirt I'm wearing. Look at all of that Schecter love. That is amazing. I'm so excited that everyone is participating in Schecter pride today. I have to tell you that I'm coming to you this morning in front of my ketubah. And my ketubah is, that's your marriage contract. When you get married, you have a ketubah. And I'm gonna show you how far back my Schecter pride goes. My husband and I are both alumni of Solomon Schecter. And we had an artist make our ketubah. And I'm gonna show you, let's see if I can actually do this well. I'm gonna zoom in here. Let's see if you can see it. Can you guys see right there? Give me a thumbs up if you can see it. That is the Schecter logo before we changed it. That's the old logo. So the Solomon Schecter logo was actually is in my ketubah from when we got married. That is how much Schecter pride I have. So kudos to all of you for showing your Schecter pride this morning. I am going to share my screen and we're gonna jump in and do announcements. All right, here we go. Shavua Tov. Uh, as a reminder, if you feel like taking some pictures and posting them, hashtag Schecter Proud and Schecter Spirit. Would love to see some of those pictures today and share the, the Schecter love. Today is Monday, March 23rd, 2020. Hayom Yom Sheni, Chafzayin Ve'adar, Taf Shin Fei. We're going to begin with the Pledge of Allegiance and the prayer for the State of Israel. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Avinu Shabasha Maim, Tzur Yisrael v'goalo, Barach et Medinat Yisrael, Reshit Smichat Geulatena. We do have two birthdays today. Simon Levitan, happy birthday. And Jacob Simon, happy birthday. Hope you get to do fun things in your house for your birthday today. We do have a few announcements today. If you miss a class for whatever reason, we're gonna change something up. The, the internet has been a little overwhelmed with all of the videos. So what you're gonna do if you miss a class is you're gonna go to the bottom of your grades schedule, the, pay, the homepage, and you're gonna click on miss a class, click here to request a video. And then we will make sure you get the exact video that you need. So that is just a change happening this week for anyone who needs to access videos from classes. Another announcement, if you would like to make your actions count, and you'd like to brighten another person's day, we have an opportunity through CJE Senior Life where you can send cards and pictures to the elderly. Um, and there are email addresses on the homepage of our online portal. So you can take pictures, you can scan, you can send them directly to those email addresses. So I hope that you'll take a few minutes of your day, make a nice picture. A lot of our elderly aren't able to see their family and their friends right now because of all of the restrictions. And I can promise you that you will make someone's day if you make a picture for them. So that is one announcement. I'm going to leave all the places you'll go up for one more day. I had some requests of people who didn't watch the video over the weekend or Friday. So I'm gonna leave that video up, whoops, uh, one more day. And uh, I'll put up a new one tomorrow. All right, I'm gonna stop sharing my screen and here's what I'm gonna do. We have time for a question of the day. 
So here's my question of the day. And you'll be able to do your electronic Zoom raising of your hands, and I'll take two or three people. So here's the question of the day. Before we do our saying about our actions and our words, I think it is even more true now during challenging times and we're all stuck inside and life can be kind of hard. Our words and our actions really do matter. So here's my question. What advice do you have? What can we do now while we're in our houses to make our words and our actions count? What's something specific that you might be able to do for someone else, whether it's someone in your house or someone in the community? What can you do? All right, Ram, I'm going to unmute you. All right, Ram, go for it. Give us an idea. I forgot. You forgot, no problem at all. All right, I'm gonna look and see. All right, I see the Shulman household, Is it, but I don't see anyone right in front of the camera. Is someone there? All right, I'm gonna un- I'm gonna un- Um, so um, you can write somebody's name basically by, uh, by giving them a card or giving them a phone call or giving somebody a good comment. Give them a hug. I love those ideas. Thank you so much. So think about who you can call today, who maybe might be, maybe they're home alone. Maybe they don't have a household full of people. Who can you send an email to? Who can you call? Those are great ideas, great ideas. All right, I see, I think I see Carell. I'm gonna unmute you. Carell, I think you're in outer space. All right, go for it, Carell. Give us another idea. Corel, do you have anything, honey? You know what? We can't hear you. There might be, I unmuted you, but it's not working. So I'm going to, whoop, we're going to see. I think someone's trying to help. All right. I'm going to take one more, and I'll come back to you and see if it works, okay? All right. I'm going to see who else's hand is up. All right. The Chesler household. Tommy, I'm going to unmute you. Can you tell us something that we can do to make someone's day better? Um, we could write a letter to them or we could FaceTime them. And All right. FaceTime is absolutely a great thing to do. All right. I'm going to just come back and see if we can get Corel working. Let's see if I can find you. All right. Corel, you want to try one more time? All right, I think Corel's not working, that's okay. Sometimes the technology works and sometimes it doesn't. I love that there are other ideas out there. I will ask more questions each day, but you need to get to class. So remember that every action counts and every word has power. So choose actions and words that will make the world a better and kinder place. Have a great day, I will see you tomorrow.